This slow cooker pot roast beef makes an inexpensive joint of meat into a delicious family meal. A full dinner, including the veg, all cooked in one pot. First we're going to heat the oil to sear the beef. My crock pot's got a searing function so I'm going to do it in there, but if yours doesn't that's fine. You can just do these initial stages in a frying pan and then transfer to your slow cooker later. We're going to season the roast joint with a mixture of salt, pepper and celery salt. Then place into the oil, turning a few times until it's browned and sealed on all sides. Now we're going to add the thyme, garlic, red wine and beef stock and then bring it to the boil. If you've seared the meat in a pan then you can transfer the meat and the liquid into the slow cooker at this point. Now we add in the potatoes, carrots and shallots. Now place the lid on and cook for 5-6 to six hours on high or 7-8 to eight hours on low. About 20 minutes before the beef is ready, add the green beans to the slow cooker. After that 20 minutes is up, we're going to transfer the beef, carrots, green beans and shallots onto a large serving dish. We're going to reserve the potatoes to one side to make some super tasty rustic mashed potato. We'll mash those potatoes with the skin still on with a knob of butter and a good glug of double cream. For the remaining cooking juices, either transfer them to a pan over a high heat or use a searing function on your slow cooker and then stir in a cornflour slurry to thicken. There you go, that's my one pot roast beef served with vegetables, mashed potato and a luscious rich gravy. Hope you like it. Don't forget to subscribe. See you next time.